Welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. This is the Saving Your Campaign or Saving Your Disaster Campaign run. We're still at the failed psionic rush. This is I think episode number 11 or 12 and it's definitely going to be the last one. Today we are invading the alien facility operated by an extremely powerful and dangerous alien that is guarding this facility. Fair enough. Um, we wanted to kind of finalize uh, that wonderful run by using our newly formed squad team. We got our first captain. Um, it is Captain Schwartz, the Templar. We got a couple of lieutenants. Actually, everyone is a lieutenant. Upgraded weapons. We got upgraded armor. Um, we got blue screen rounds, like I promised it, in our um, event list you can see we're going for plasma grenades afterwards upgraded med uh, medical packs and we got some special armor and grenades uh, coming in we're taking um, a delirium the uh, player simply needs to research plasma weapons afterwards i left the the, uh, the game with sufficient resources um, and a very very respectable income that's going to come in um, soon and last but not least if he really needs new soldiers uh, the, uh, the player that sent this mission just needs to make contact here um, and we'll get the live fire training uh, where any recruit will start uh, in the gts will start as a sergeant so that's um, kind of it let's take a look at the armory before we go into the mission um, I received the save game with only one sergeant and an almost dead sergeant. The rest were corporal and squaddies. We had only 15, 12 or 15 soldiers when we started the run. You can see in the Memorial of the Fallen that there were just a lot of uh, soldiers who died overall. So that's what thinned out the roster. If we now take a look at the roster, just up, um, just factually speaking, we have two, four, six, eight, ten lieutenants uh, and two, four sergeants. So that's 14, um, uh, 14 units that are at least as high as the units that I had before. Um, and we completely, completely turned this uh, run around. This is definitely an unstuck run. If we look at the um, avatar project i took it over with a full avatar project we're now um, reducing it again uh, back into a reasonable level um, he still has another facility here so that's definitely possible to win um, and yeah with that being said we're launching the mission just wanted to uh, to show everyone where that safe game is uh, is heading to i am thinking about uh, uploading the save game file so that uh, if you as a viewer are interested to continue that particular campaign I might um, make that happen maybe you found interest in actually continuing that campaign and want to give it a try yourself I think with a reasonable um, effort you can fin uh, finish this legendary Iron Man campaign um, from here on it's it's basically just mid to late game uh, play and you have all of the cool fights ahead of you the alien rulers are just about to spawn then the chosen ones so it's a pretty uh, if you like mid to end game then this year is definitely the right game all right I'm going in the team is ready, motivated, and extremely confident that we're going to do this run. We don't have any time pressure, which means we're going to play it carefully. I am trusting you. We also know that there is an alien ruler somewhere here, which again means we're playing it carefully. Could be either of the three alien rulers to be precise so i am interested okay. in seeing what kind of alien ruler we're going to find there's high ground there's high ground there's high ground like the facility is over here so 
I want to start with taking high ground uh, here, actually taking a couple of shots with the sniper and afterwards let's Position just see confirmed. if there are more patrols. Time to motor. I'll lead the way. Emma Schwartz here, probably my favorite character in this run. Bladestone uh, Templar, very very strong. Incredibly powerful. So we're taking our scout. I go where I am needed. And I would like to take a peek. I believe this would be subject Gamma. Fallen created a Viper King. Just what we needed. Interesting. I mean, we can shoot the Viper King from here. Hmm. I mean, not too shabby. To be honest, perfect option for a shrapnel. Just throwing the shrapnel here, getting rid of the armor, and then starting to hit it. Same holds true for Rolling. for the tower. Which, by the way, we can also haywire protocol. Moving to designated coordinates. Yeah, let's do some shenanigans with the uh, with the okay. watch Reaper, watch. just to show off how strong the class is actually. So, I would suggest we're killing this pack here first. And afterwards we're going to take care about the... the chosen one. Uh, not the chosen one, the um, alien ruler. So, how about... Yeah, I mean, positioning ourselves up here is dangerous because if they come closer, they can actually take an auto shot. I'm almost more inclined to um, to just hit him. Eighty <clears throat> percent. You know what? Let's kill the sector. We go. Kill confirmed. Cover's blown. Because I know that we can tank him. He just needs to come a bit closer. Yeah, there we go. I go where you tell me. I've spotted an alien patrol. Easy peasy. So this year the remote start will take care of Uh, we'll take care of half of the health of um, the Archon. Again, just demonstrating how strong the Reaper is. Cost us um, a full cover spot here. But in return, we're dealing 12 points of damage. And we're not even revealing ourselves. So we do have Holo Target here. Super useful. Even if we don't hit him, the holo target just helps immensely. Oh, we even re uh, 
retained the high, uh, the full cover there. Orders Interesting. Okay, we're definitely not going to use our mimic in here. Yeah, not even close. Hair trigger, Overwatch. No one will slip past. There's another patrol. Um, and maybe we can just pull the other patrol as well. By the way, the tree just disappeared. Damn. Oak says I am to obey. Okay, so if we were to pull him, yeah, I think that's reasonable. We're going to overwatch because that means if they are moving into our direction we're going to take automatic uh, the, the sniper with his long watch is going to take a shot and that will pull the full pack into our direction need to get the heavy a bit further to the front line right about here so i think that should be a full overwatch and we're going to reload the weapon as soon as they move, the sniper should take a shot. There we go. So that's one technique uh, that you can use in order to gain an extra round. Because they will now uh, charge into our direction. There we go. One of them down. And the puri pur uh, purifier takes some damage as well. He did not even manage to go like close enough to us, right? Enemy destroyed. Ready to go. Right, reload. Reload Overwatch. And we're taking another full cover spot over here. Pretty solid positioning that we're having. I like it. I think it's time to to see if we can find uh, the alien ruler. There's another patrol. That's not a problem. There's the alien ruler. Need to be careful. Might even trigger it. Ah. That's not really optimal. I would rather um, have fought it uh, while it is off the screen. Let's make sure to take it out this time. Ready to rock. Okay, so first things first, the alien ruler definitely could take actions. At least on turns that the alien ruler is capable of seeing. There we go. That damage couldn't be avoided because he could not see us. So our idea is really to deal the maximum damage with the least amount of uh, of actions. It would seem Valen's creations are not intent on making peace. Stay alert for rapid movement. As it yeah, it, to it's already it's already disappearing because you only need to deal one third of its health, right? And with um, a crit, we did more than that. We do have a chance uh, with our um, repeater here to even execute it. Not sure if that's going to happen, but we can at least give it a try. I would say. Yeah, well, it's going to be back, I guess that's certain. But for this mission, or for the purpose of this mission, we already have beaten it. Like, that was a very clean shot. 
I think we got it down like it had 60, uh, 67 hit points, I think. And uh, and an armor. We ended with uh, zero armor and I think 44 hit points, and we dealt three at the end, so almost dealing 50% of its um, of its hit points as damage. No targets available, that's not good. So we will reposition. The reason why I want to reposition is because we can kill the tower. Or, no, oh, wait a second, I could have used Haywire Protocol. My bad. Again, we're not under, uh, we're not on a time constraint here. So what I want to do instead This here, yep, should give us Haywire Protocol. Let's see if we can take the tower. The answer is no, which really doesn't do anything other than having a bit more defensive values. So we're having worse times hitting this thing. With blue screen rounds, it's a one shot. Easy. Easy. Scouting a bit. There is the second tower. Go. Yeah, very smooth. Like I said, the team is very, very good. We always have our option. I mean, we even have two mimic beacons. We we did not we did not even start yet with mimic beacons, right? Okay, so here we go. Menace one five, you're near the target position. How many of these enemies are we going to hit? I think that's one only. Enjoy the show. Good enough, though. It's the start. Go, go, go! Let's do this. Scanning. It's killing time. Overwatch. All right, I guess we got everything covered. These guys inside don't even know who attacked them. They are completely clueless. It's a great option for a grenade. Can't do that, unfortunately. We're too far away. Yet. Sure thing. Heading there now. I can cover it. Tired of waiting around. 
Moving out. I'm on it. Got it covered. I'm on it. So, I mean, at no point in this run had we been really close to any any situation which would have been threatening. This is burning out of control. Yeah. Fortunately, this uh, the explosion of this here is not large enough. Moving out. And I think the explosion from outside here, although huge, is again not large enough. Watching comes naturally. been almost ambushed one last patrol that I wasn't aware of uh, that I wasn't aware of interesting well. time to remove the cover well done great shredding by the way Moving into a position. Oh, not even a crit. What the heck? Moving out. Nice one. Target neutralized. And beautiful. I recommend you to not do that in your playthrough. But I actually want to see with the blade mo uh, with the blade storm if we would be hitting first or if he's going to hit us. Yeah, the answer is he's going to hit us first. I was on a, uh, I was hoping that we could melee him. He would try to counter, and we would then try to counter. I wasn't sure how the mechanic would work. Feels a bit stupid now that I've done it. Probably shouldn't have done it. Not a problem. Give him a heal. Like I said, I, if I'd be you, I wouldn't do that. You could have easily used the mimic beacon, so it's not that I I'm wasn't aware really that out. there could have been a risk involved. Yeah. So, don't melee new uh, mutants, even not with a Templar and uh, who has Bladestorm, because apparently counterattacks. Because apparently counterattacks don't counter counterattacks. You learn something every day in XCOM about its mechanics. I mean, it makes sense if you think about it.
elsewise he could counter attack again and so on and so forth so they would just stand there kind of countering one another until the end of time Yeah, this round we're most likely going to pull some of them because the sniper is in overwatch and they are going to move. And there's the shot. Time to move in. I want to redeem the Templar. I will tear you apart. Oh, hello there, dear zombie. It's just removing cover, mostly. Hostile neutralized. This is killing a purifier and a zombie at the same time. On my way. And this here is looking at someone who has lost his cover. Yep, sucks being you, buddy. I am at your service. You know what? I you can just watch. overwatch for now. Overwatch. There is an alien activity left, so there are aliens. Although they seem to be hiding quite well. Schwartz is at full uh, at full focus. So let's see if there is someone upstairs. The answer is no, so it's probably going to be a patrol. Moving on target location. Reloaded. Got it covered. Overwatch. It's most likely not a tower because that would uh, count as um, alien activity, which means it needs to be something else. Anyhow. Okay, so I think that was it, guys. They're 
bringing in reinforcements. Menace one five, be advised, we've picked up hostile reinforcements inbound on your position. Oh yeah. You know what? Just for shits and giggles. We're going to place Emma Schwartz in the middle of all of the reinforcements so she can immediately take action. My life is in your hands. No one will cross. This is more a fun little way of ending this uh, Save My campaign. Let's go, baby. I've got eyes on Advent troops. You're shitting me. Get me out of here! Our soldiers are suffering out there. We'll need to give them some time to recover when we get back. <laughs> Okay, fear of Max, of course. Okay, so we got a uh, we got a feared soldier. Beautiful. Beautiful. But that's really actually not a problem. Got it covered. We're just killing those guys here real quick. We do have blue screen rounds, so might as well kill the mech. Target down. Nice, we got a promotion. Pretty sweet. You know what? Let's cure the fear. Did we just remove the obsession? Oh, okay, not not the underlying obsession, just the status obsession. Okay. Overwatch. My watch begins. I won't let them pass. Reloaded. Reload. Overwatch. Okay, let's see. We got another reinforcement, and that's it after this reinforcement there's not going to be any more Everyone took a nice little beating. Beautiful blade storm, by the way. Menace one five. X four charges are armed. Get to the evac point. We don't have any time to spare. Okay, that's I guess a fair statement. Just for shits and giggles, this is, by the way, how the explosion would have looked. Evacking. Not a problem. 
So we even have two ways of killing this guy. I'm choosing the one that deals more damage. Oh. And of course another zombie. Okay, fair enough. Unfortunately, we don't have another run gun. I'm Yet another promotion. Shit, this is going to be the promotion run. Nice, this is going to be the promotion run. Could have also made a flawless run out of it, but I mean, it doesn't matter. Yeah, somewhere there had been a tower somewhere, and contrary to what I was saying, apparently the tower was the reason why, why we couldn't move on. Yeah, so in hindsight, we've learned a lot in this run. Uh, I've learned that I might want to keep them a bit shorter. This here is uh, rather, I mean, 12 missions is, is, or 12 episodes is probably a bit too long. I'll probably cut it in half and no we've seen the last of do about two in-game months. That needs to be enough to, um, uh, to, to sol uh, salvage a run. We're going to skill um, face off. By the way, a huge breaking point. The captain with face off can deal so much damage, specifically with blue screen rounds. Uh, we got chain shot here. Also, very, very good. Basically, doubles the damage. Just need to make sure that she has enough uh, to hit. Well, that's okay. Got threat assessment here. Again, very good breaking point. Uh, you can give threat assessment to others and to herself just to have extra attacks. So we got a lot of captains now. Four to be precise. Got an advanced scope. That's fine. And we delayed the avatar project. That's pretty good. And I mean, look at the guerrilla tactics school, right? You have all of the um, individual ones here mentally awake. Um, Starts with one focus. I would uh, say that's pretty good. Uh, Deadshot is extremely good. 10% crit just flat out is a good bonus. Um, cool under pressure can be good. Biggest booms is, are also is also fine. I would probably go for mental awake and Deadshot first. So lots of options to upgrade the troops further. I say thank you for watching that uh, first. Um, first uh, installment together with me and this is where I officially declare this campaign as to be no longer stuck or fucked and we're going to end it here. If you have liked what you've seen uh, give it a thumbs up and a comment down below. Uh, keep in mind if you want your mission to be submitted here psychen 4 games at gmail.com I post it uh, as well in the video description I am looking for more submissions. Lately. Thank you so much. It sounds and a little have like a German, great day.